So next we're going to look at an upper arm injury or a humerus injury. So it's an injury to the upper arm bone. And to immobilize this, we can do kind of two methods. We can do that sling and swath, and we can also use our moldable aluminum splint to add some further securement for the elbow. So same way we did this for the forearm, except for the upper arm, we're going to get caught in the armpit. So what we're going to do with one side is take this and fold it back on itself. Okay, and again, curve that in. So now what we can do is get the patient's elbow in here, secure that on this way. We can take our elastic wrap and then wrap this on. And again, we're just doing it snug, nothing crazy too tight. And then once we've got it kind of up to the top, then we can take this, tuck in our tail. So that helps secure kind of the elbow and the upper arm a bit. Now what we can add to this is again that sling and swath. So we can again take our sling and start this underneath the injured arm. Get our right angle to the elbow. Bring this up and over. And tie this on. And then again we can take our swath and tie this around. And this gives us a good bit of securing. This is okay to go around the arm because you have that shell of the splint on the outside protecting this band from causing, causing further injury. And you'd want to leave the uninjured arm out so they can do things, scratch your nose, whatever they need to do. So that's securing of the upper arm injury in a non-stable injury.